I don't know about you guys, but it really feels like something big is about to happen in the crypto market, something explosive. We're seeing some movements when it comes to Shiba Inu right now we haven't seen in a while. And frankly, there are some entities that are talking about a potential big rally ahead for Bitcoin. Now, obviously, there's no guarantees in crypto, but what we've kind of been waiting for is really price just to pick up again. We're waiting for more excitement. And in this time where, where things have been flat and there hasn't been a whole lot going on, there has been something that has been taking place. Whales have been aggressively stocking up. Large entities have been building their positions, not just in Shiba Inu, but across the broader crypto market. Not only have they been building, they've been removing supply from exchanges. It's not what this video is about, but they're adding in insanely impressive ways. In fact, there was a whale just the other day that added $6 million worth of Shiba Inu. So what is happening? Why are we seeing this, this tick up in buying? Why are people accumulating during these times? Well, smart money guys, when you tend to hit the floor, when you tend to hit the bottom and trade sideways before the next leg up, they tend to accumulate in a very big way. And now here's the interesting thing. There are actually analysts that are calling for a potential big rally in terms of Bitcoin. So this is from K33 he said there's a big rally signal in Bitcoin. And what they're specifically talking about is open interest when it comes to BTC. So they said continuous swap funding rates have averaged negative levels over the past week while open interest has risen sharply. This data shows that Bitcoin is being shorted aggressively and that structure short positions are heading towards a squeeze. Such short squeezes force investors to close their bearish bets, setting the stage for surprise price jumps. And just looking at what this BTC liquidation map looks like, guys, I mean, we do have a lot of short interest above here. You're talking about hundreds of millions of dollars of short interest actually pushing the price of Bitcoin down, trying to keep us from going higher. But here's the thing. We have seen this happen time and time again. We have seen these shorts get wrecked time and time again. Yes, there is some some longs that have opened positions before here or below here. Yes, there is the potential for long liquidations as well. When we look at what's happening later this week, there is the potential that things continue to climb into this Jackson Hole meeting. There is a potential that excitement begins to pick off, really pick up. Really, the only reason we got a drop off last night was because of the Mount Gox money that I talked about um, in a video, my ADA video earlier today. We had a little bit of Mount Gox money on the move. There was a distribution uh, to the tune of $700 million that took place. They sent $75 million to exchanges, so it caused a little bit of a pullback. But when we start working into some of these levels, the liquidations are going to be insane. Price is going to move very quickly like it did on the way up towards 61K. Now, what's even more interesting, guys, is if we if we zoom out here, oh, that went out too far. Well, here, this is a good representation. Look at what exists up above here at 70K. There are people betting so heavily against the market that have gotten comfortable in these ranges. And there is short interest that is even filled in in these ranges just above here between 60 to 70K. So these movements can start taking place really at any time. All you need is a single trigger, uh, large enough entities to accumulate and send the price moving. You get into some of these liquidations and the snowball starts rolling downhill. It happens very quickly. These people who have been accumulating during these times are, been, are rewarded in a big way. Now, again, there's no guarantees. This is not financial advice or anything like that. You kind of need a, a good culmination of any, everything together. You need the positive sentiment pickup. You need buying to pick up. And when we get into some of these short liquidations, that's when you see this start to snowball even faster. You start to see more people get excited. SHIB starts going on major runs. We start working our way into some of these levels like we've talked about here. It's the stage is set, all right? The stage is set for this big move. It's a question about whether we're gonna execute or not. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, what you think is about to happen, but have a great day. Show your love below. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.